Some West Mobile County residents are upset over the Mobile Area Water Sewer System's decision to allow the city of Mobile to annex the land in and around Big Creek Lake. Mobile's drinking water supply. Moss held a board meeting today to hear resident concerns and WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones was there. Yeah, the residents I spoke with are just wanting a better understanding as to why the city of Mobile is looking to annex the city's largest water source. A packed Moss board meeting Monday, so packed that some people weren't allowed inside the room, all with one question. Why they even think they need to to take it over. Moss has agreed to allow the city of Mobile to annex Big Creek Lake and the 9,000 acres of land surrounding it. Some concerned citizens are wondering what annexing the lake will mean for them. I do have property uh, joining Moss, and so I'm here just concerned about what's going to happen. What are what are they going to do? And other citizens are questioning how quickly the decision was made. Like we found out about it through the news. So there was never a mail out, never a community meeting about it, not anything, nothing. With a packed Moz meeting, citizens made one thing clear. Not one person I spoke to was in favor of this. Our biggest concern is if the city comes in and takes Moss and the surrounding areas, which is the 9,000 acres surrounding it, where is it going to stop? Ma's board members told the residents that they're simply allowing the city to annex the Big Creek Lake property. City of Mobile spokesperson Candace Cooksey sent us a statement that says, in part, no official annexation plans or proposals have been put forward and we have not discussed any effort to annex a significant number of residential properties. Our focus has been exploring ways to protect Big Creek Lake and its headwaters. Moz owns the vast majority of the property around Big Creek Lake. I don't, I can't speak for everybody out there, but I don't think nobody out there would, would voluntarily be annexed into the city of Mobile. You know, but what the, what Moz is doing is giving them a gateway to approach us about it. Now I reached out to Moz to see if this decision would potentially increase water rates, and they told me no, it would not. Reporting in Mobile, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.